Yo, what up, guys? The title in this video should be self-explanatory. You guys want to learn how to get 10 skill points in less than 2 minutes. I'm going to show you what car to use. Uh, Shoutouts to Rageous, you know who you are, for letting me know about this car. You need to use the Renault 5 Turbo, the Forza Edition one. And you need to have these perks. Only these perks. You don't need the other three. So if you want to pause the video, go ahead and you'll see which ones to get. Um, basically what you have to do is just get the 7 time multiplier with 72,000 points. And I'm going to do this right now just to show you. You gain a lot of skill points. Because, you know, this recent update really fucked everything up when it comes to skill points and the car perks that you've earned. Kind of decided everything. So, basically, I'm just going to teach you how to get these skill points back as quickly as, as possible. So, once you get to like 72,000. Um, 72,000 points with the 7 time multiplier, you'll get this to 10. Skill points that you can use towards you know, the cars that you um, want to upgrade, but I wouldn't use the skill points, I would just bank them. Because the update that I recently learned now, every time you basically close the game and reopen the game, it's still reset. So every time you open up the game, every every skill point you put into a perk, it's gone. So there's no point in basically giving skill points for perks. I mean, this process takes just a little bit. It would be much easier if there were actual items on this runway, because I practically just It's a tedious process. The grind is kind of boring, but it's worth it at the end because you've seen how many skill points I actually have. But right now I've been doing this for like an hour. It's, really hard, like, really hard. it's the stupidest and easiest method to gain skill points really quickly. Personally, I like it. It's I've done I've done a lot more boring shit than this, but this makes up for, you know, this glitch that's been happening as of late. So like I said, remember, just bank your skill points. Don't spend it on any cars. Unless you want to, and then get a reset. But if you want your cars fully maxed out and everything like that, you would just save. And there you have it. Ten skill points. And you get XP on top of that, like 4,000 XP for each run you do. So you, your influence will increase. I've been doing this, and I got 322 so far. And that's basically it. Thanks for watching, yo.